Now, flag bearer of the National Democratic Congress, John Dramani Mahama, has revealed plans of his government, if successful, to relocate government or some government institutions and agencies outside of the capital. This is a grand plan to decongest the nation's capital. The former president addressing the Greater Accra Regional House of Chiefs reveals a feasibility study will be conducted to ensure a successful implementation. My colleague Nana Ojima is touring the region with Mr. Muhammad and sent this report. The Greater Accra region is a fortive to be visited by the Building Ghana Tour of the NDC. At a meeting with the Regional House of Chiefs, various traditional rulers present were given the opportunity to air their views on some issues of concern. Vice President of the House, Professor Ni Wolenchi, spoke on their behalf. As chiefs and fathers of the land, we support all our children in this election competition. Therefore, any chief tying and allying his gaggles around a particular political party is doing a disservice to the very people he is supposed to rule. I urge our chiefs to desist from partisan politics and save your integrity. We all know this year is an election year. Come December 7, we shall all be going to the polls to cast our votes. Can we have politics without insults and unwarranted blames? Yes, we can. John Mahama shared the NDC's plans to deal with traffic and congestion concerns in the city. He shares plans to relocate some state institutions intention to build highways and extend rail services to these areas we are looking to decongest accra so when we come into office we're going to undertake a feasibility study to move some of the government agencies and the ministries outside the city so that we can free up more space and reduce the traffic congestion in the system so some of the ministries some of the government departments, agencies, we will move them outside Accra, not too far. There will be a highway between that place and Accra. We can even put uh, train services between so that you can just board a train and go do your business and come back. Meanwhile, improving the transport system in the capital remains central goal to the NDC. Mr. Mahama says the Ayololo transit system will be revived if he is successful at staging a comeback. Then aside from that, Accra is a rapidly expanding um, uh, uh, cosmopolitan area, a huge metropolis. And so we need to improve the transportation service in Accra. And that's why when as president, we introduced the Ayalulu bus service. Unfortunately, our successors have virtually abandoned it. And so I want to assure you that when we come, we're going to revamp the Ayalulu bus service so that it can service all parts of Accra and let people able to ride the buses to wherever they want to go. Because we want to introduce a 24-hour economy, we must have an efficient transportation system so that people can go to work at any time of the day or the night.